Hello, and welcome to another Tech Tip video. Today we will be going over the CAD Admin Dashboard. This feature is available to members on active subscription. You can get there by first going to the SolidWorks.com website and logging into the customer portal. Once logged in, you can click on CAD Admin Dashboard listed under References. Once inside, you can see each account name in their own rows listed with additional information like unsupported graphics drivers, low memory, and the date that these were last updated. You can change which columns are displayed by going up to the drop down box by the columns, highlighting over columns, and selecting which columns you would like to be displayed. Additionally, you can add each of these accounts into their own groups, like the tech support group I have here. To do this, simply select all of the accounts that you would like joined together, and now you can click on the Manage Group in the toolbar. Here we can add the selected accounts to any existing groups we have created. We can create a new one, or we can delete any of these previously created groups. You can also choose which version of SOLIDWORKS you would like to look at, as well as the conditions for the red status flags that you see next to each account. You can change these options, and when you're done, hit Submit. Now you will notice that the flags have gone away. We can also filter these results by clicking the filter icon and choosing anything we would like here. To remove filters, you just need to press on the filter icon once again and hit Clear All Filters. If you'd like to delete any count, you need to select it and then click the highlighted Delete Accounts option. All of this information can also be exported to either an Excel document or a CSV file. With an account selected, you can look at further details like the system options located on this machine. Here, if we look at the whole wizard information, we can see which values have been checked in the system options. For all accounts, you can also look at the machine details. This will provide you with information like how much storage space is still freed and how much RAM the computer has. This can be very beneficial, especially when looking at the graphics driver and whether or not this is currently supported by SOLIDWORKS. You can also view your RX benchmarking results by clicking on the RX Benchmark tab. Here, any scores that you have submitted to SOLIDWORKS will show up for this account. Lastly, you can look at session details. Here you will see information like the amount of normal sessions per day, the amount of killed sessions per day, and the amount of crashed sessions per day. All of this information is only uploaded to the CAD Admin Dashboard when the Customer Experience Program is turned on within SOLIDWORKS. This feature can be turned on or off by going to System Options, and under the General tab, you can click the bottom checkbox.